Oh yeah. Oh, That's straight. That is straight weed. Dude. That's insane. We really just found that shit. Is this still smokable? I don't know. <laughs> This motherfucker wide ass open. Three M closed and moved operations to Mexico in 2006 after a chemical accident injured several people. When we began filming, we had no idea of the drug operation going on around the property. It's been like this for since 2006. Not wide open like this, but. Just abandoned in general. This was a break room. Last time I filmed in here, it had carpet still in the, uh, like, there's still microwaves and stuff in here. And this place was originally a, um, like a sawmill, uh, I believe. And this was the original sawmill build building, just this one little section. how bad it was in here. Front desk used to be right here too. They ripped that all up. I mean, they just, there's broken windows everywhere and this place used to be so under like, it used to be so like locked up. There's another upstairs too, but it doesn't have uh, that much in it. It's just offices, big empty rooms. Huh? Uh, I don't honestly know. I mean, they've ripped it down in here. That used to be a um, there used to be a set of offices over there. When I filmed this property once in 2018, it looked completely different. It's notorious for strange happenings, unexplainable events, and being heavy with paranormal activity, much of which I have experienced myself. That little um area right here. This was a like an office space. It's been gutted.
I wonder if those, huh? No, I, I get it. It's, um, I used to come in here alone at night. That was, uh, that was pretty bad. I wonder if this, yep, it's still just as bad as it was before. Holy shit. It's actually gotten worse. Yeah, the roof is like pretty bad in here. I just wonder if um they uh removed any of the or if any of these doors back here are open. There's doors back here, like there is in the front. I just wonder if they open these to let it air out back here. I doubt it, but they've removed like every bit of electrical. Yeah, freight elevator. The paint is peeling in here so bad. That's how old everything is. What? <laughs> I don't know, go for it. Oh wow. At this point we still hadn't noticed the greenhouse in the back. We later see a camper we now believe was used by the operation to watch over the grow houses but at the time weren't sure if it was occupied by security. Wow. I wonder what that did. Oh, okay. Oh, no, I remember them now that you say something. The paint peeling on this is so bad. It's like lead, straight lead paint. There's an eyewash station over there. People were so proud to work here too.
Don't talk over here, because I don't know if there's anyone out here. I want to know, do they have a guy just living in an RV down here? Is that what that is? There's like an old beat up Mercedes parked here. Although I can't tell if it's registered. And there's uh there's no more vehicles here. There used to be vehicles parked everywhere. Oh wait. Office check-in. I bet that was for the demo crew maybe. I don't that's weird. How can you tell? That car is black. No, in that camper. No. Far. Yeah, I know. The camper is. You don't know if somebody's inside of that camper. I want to know what they were doing over there. Oh, yeah, this car's unregistered. Brand new rims inside too. This is new. This wasn't here when I explored last time. They used to have uh, equipment over here and they were running a uh, landscaping business. And I just wonder what the fuck this is all for. Were they doing COVID testing here? What's in that? This is for greenhouse. Really? Holy shit. Dude, was this a grow house? Holy shit, so they were growing weed in here. Yeah, you can smell it. Kinda, I got a little whiff back there. Holy shit. This was really just a fucking grow house. This is brand fucking, they look like house. That's weird, I bet it. You know what I bet happened here? This would make sense. They were using this as a grow house because it's out in the middle of here. And they were running a landscaping business off of this place. And um, they probably came in here. And the feds probably found it. And shut it down. And why the whole place is wide open is probably because the um, they probably searched the entire building. Look at that. And confiscated everything. Any in there? Nah, it's just exactly the same. I mean, that it, that makes sense. Hmm? Oh, shit. Is that? Yes, it is. Is that weed? It's part of what was weed. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Then. Like that's uh that's crazy that we just found that. Oh yeah. That's straight. That is straight weed. Dude. That's insane. We really just found that shit. Is it still smokable? I don't know. That's insane. Look at this. They they had it hanging from the fucking... Holy shit. That's where they were drying it, I bet. They were drying it from the ceiling. Some of the smoke out of these is that is insane. I, don't know. I, just, I really cannot believe we just found that. They definitely were doing that here, and they just got fucking raided. They spent a lot of money for this, too. That's fucking insane. That is a straight up dead weed plant.
And this was another greenhouse. This is so fucking insane, dude. This is the most insane shit I think I've ever fucking found in my my any any time I fucking explored. This is crazy, dude. Like what the fuck? After filming and digging around more, we discovered traces that this was a much bigger and most likely gang-affiliated drug operation covering as a demolition of the building that in the end went south and was quickly dismantled. Raided and shit. Somebody's gonna be angry. That's fucking insane. The fucking power is still on. Don't touch any of the and recording the temperature. Holy shit. It can't be accurate. It's literally it's at least 20 degrees out here. No, it's it's definitely like I don't know. It could be. I wonder if the lights in here work or anything. I don't know, cause the there's no lights in anyway. We took them all out. There's no light bulbs. Oh yeah, they removed the uh, the breaker. Wow, <laughs> that's fucking that's ridiculous. That's so fucking insane, dude. What the fuck? Holy shit. What the fuck? Dude, this feels so bad. We didn't look in the bathroom. I don't. Don't don't start don't start going through shit. Someone's been here not long ago. Oh my god, dude. Oh. Dude. Yeah, I don't like this. What is in that? It's a poker set. I think I don't like it. All right, we need to shut this back up. Just, I just just shut the door. I don't uh. Okay, it's not gonna, but that that's fine. Let's just um, let's just keep exploring. We haven't been in the, that full part yet. We can either we have two options. We can go into that section over there, or we can go. There's another building down here that's uh, filled with like pool, like a. This was like a water treatment area down here. So we just found these pools up here. on top of a mountain thing and they're just straight it's really crazy water. like household pools you said this is where they treated the water yeah that's where you pipe it from man what the fuck this was these are expensive these alone these pools are like Six hundred to a thousand dollars a piece themselves, huh? I I would say. Yeah, but still, there's one, two, three, four of them. That right there is. Yeah, there could have been more. All right. Well. Yeah, but how were they filtering the water down there? I'm guessing they had a pipeline that went down there. Holy shit. All right.
Let's get let's get the fuck down there and just keep keep exploring. Sun's starting to set. Yeah, this was the um, entrance, the back entrance for trucks to uh, load and do different things. Oh, I thought the lights were on in there for a second. I was like, what? This was water treatment, though. It, um... They've locked this building up, though. I don't know why. Oh, I remember. You can, um... You can go around the other way, and you can go inside of this... I'm not climbing up there for this little thing. I remember being inside of this building though. That does look like a new lock though. But if I remember correctly, there was an entrance. Yeah, it's right there. It's back in here. It smells like pee in here. That's human pee. This wasn't water for me, this is waste. Waste? Yeah. Really? Because we're here on the deck. Waste Yeah. That, that's just fucking. That's just uh, first aid kit. Oh, waste plant. Okay. Maybe it was. Oh, this probably... This could be where the chemical accident happened because, um... The, uh... This was a both a water... They had a water treatment plant, which I think the one on the other side is the treatment plant. What? This is all lab work. Oh. But they had, um... This would have been waste, which means that they would have handled dangerous chemicals coming out of the factory. sulfuric acid. That's cool. Why is it so full of water? That's ice now. Watch out, there's like spit right there. Is that spit? No, it's not spit. That's what you do. Spit. I, I wouldn't step on it. it. There's sulfuric acid shit right there. Okay. There's something underneath this. Really? There's a door here. Oh, it's probably... Oh. That's the biosphere. Oh. Confined space. Let me open this. Try and open that. Oh. Oh my god. There's tunnels underneath this place. Dude. What the fuck? We pushed on for a bit longer to show the rest of the building, unsure if anyone would return to the property before nightfall. You talking about that? Oh, no.
The fuck? What the fuck was that? Porn. Just why were they just randomly beeping though? After a car drove by multiple times laying on the horn, and with the sun setting, we decided it would be best to leave before anyone showed up. 